Hello there, it's Will from Travel with Will and we are in Lausanne still. I'm going to show you my favourite shopping street in Lausanne. It's, it's in the old area, you've got Le Flan and then you've got this one, it's where all the expensive shops are and there's nice cafe and so on. But before we go down there, I'm going to show you this piece of artwork here. I think that's really cool. Lausanne's got really a strange little attention to detail things like this wolf here. Why is he here? There is, <laughs> there was actually a pig I saw earlier. I think they have the statues um, in some of my other videos. You see uh, the Lausanne videos, you'll see um, a man staring at a naked woman in the park down in U Duchi, Uchi. But yeah, here we are. This is a very pretty part of Lausanne. I'm going to give you a few tips as well in this video. So I'll just turn you around here. It's kind of the start of the main shopping street. We nearly got ran over by this man here. Um, yes, yeah, so a tip number one, comfortable shoes, everything's uphill, it's very, very uh, hilly. If you're from England, imagine you are in Sheffield where everything's up a hill, it's very hilly. You've got beautiful buildings like this by the way here, it's very pretty. So this is called Rue de Bourges, Bourg, pardon and it's the main shopping street here, so it's like their equivalent of Rue de Rhone. And we're gonna have a little wander down there. So, kind of advice or tips for coming. If you're driving here, I would park in Uchi, which is down by the lake. Uh, it's like their little lake area. And when you park there, you can get the metro up to the old town and to be honest if you're coming for the day I wouldn't even bother walking I'd just get the metro straight there because there's nothing to see between there is a very pretty thing here though it's loads of little things like that so we're now on the, the street here so the metro's reasonably priced, it's a bit more expensive than in Geneva. Lots of tourists here today. So here's the start of the road. And then we're going to walk down it. So we've got loads of the traditional women's clothes shops, of course. This is your dream street, ladies. I'll show you some of the... Sh Let's do a bit of window shopping. Why not? Pourquoi pas? Yes, so tip number one is use the metro. It's, it's worth it and you'll save time. I did speak to a very nice Spanish couple and they said to me they've come from Zurich, um, they've gone to Bern, Interlaken, now they are here and they're going to end their trip in Geneva and I said to them you're most probably better off just going to Geneva instead of spending another day here because there's not much to do um, so Uchi metro to the city centre old town shopping street there is one beautiful park as well if we get time we'll go there but yeah Lausanne is not Zurich or Geneva so don't if you're planning a holiday don't give as much time to uh, Lausanne definitely more fun in Geneva or Zurich but I do love Lausanne we've got lovely little passages like this and yeah so I'm trying to think of other things I did see some really good buffets actually and I think the food's a bit cheaper than in Geneva and it's more of the, um, Geneva is the CERN, so you've got the physics. 
whereas here the students are more biology based and it's very much a student town so it's in Canton Vaux as well I should have been doing some window shopping shouldn't I instead of rambling but I like rambling and you seem to enjoy it let me, let me know if you if you like the rambling okay just for the girls we've got some handbags here why don't you tell me which one you think would look best on me <laughs> oh let's have a look <laughs> Of course, none of them are good. Oh, we've got the Rolex over here. None of them are good enough for me. I wouldn't mind one of these watches though. Let's have a look at these. This is for the men. This is for the men. Yeah, so it's actually quite a nice shopping street. I think Rue de Rhone is a bit better. Let's see, you've got another window here. Yeah, another thing I think about Lausanne is it's more, it's, I'll just show you this little bit here. This is, I just love stuff like this. This is what I love about Switzerland. Um, Lausanne seems a bit more real. It seems like I'm back in the UK in a little bit. You know, um, it's just, it seems more normal. Whereas Zurich and uh, Geneva, they seem like you're, you've been put in a weird world where everything is very crazy and it's hard to explain. But if you are a foreigner, I please, Tell me if you if you understand what I'm saying when you go to these places. Zurich is just like um, crazy expensive, and it's just very beautiful. Geneva is also a very international city, so you could almost be in London. Whereas this, to me, feels like the first city in Switzerland. So Geneva feels just like a an international bubble. Lausanne is where it starts for me. And Zurich is also a, a strange international bubble, but I love both of them. Let's have a look at this building here. So as always, it was a pleasure to show you the main shopping street. You do get strange artwork like this as well. And yes, I just wanted to show you this road because it's kind of like Rue de Rhone in Geneva. And I'm actually thinking the park is down that road there. If you go down there, you're at the train station. And then from the train station, you can go down to the lake. So this is kind of like where the old town starts, in my opinion. And please like, comment, subscribe. I hope you join me on the next uh, walk or travel exploration. And thank you for watching. I really appreciate you commenting and let's explore together. So thank you very much. I'll see you in the next video.